The sin of one who misses the afternoon prayer. The, the message of Allah said, the one who misses the afternoon prayer is like one deprived of his family and wealth. Later that the Prophet said, the one who abandons the afternoon prayer has had his deeds voided. The sin of the one who delays the afternoon prayer, the afternoon prayer, until the sun is yellow and low toward the horizon. That he heard the Messenger of Allah say that is the prayer of the hypocrite. He sits watching the sun until it is between the two horns of the devil, and then he stands praying for a cow quickly like the pattern of a bird not remembering Allah but little. It is preferred to pray the sunset prayer immediately and it is disliked to delay it. May Allah be pleased with him, narrated that the Prophet said, My nation shall come to be in a good state, or he said upon the natural way, as long as they do not delay the sunset prayer until the numerous stars appear together. May Allah be pleased with him, narrated that the messenger, messenger of Allah would pray the sunset prayer when the when the sun would set and disappear behind the horizon, it is preferred to delay the night prayer as long as there is no causing of hardship. One night the Prophet waited until most of the night had passed and the people in the mosque were sleeping, and then he went out and prayed. He said this would be its time if it were not to be a hardship upon my nation. The disapproval of sleeping before the night prayer and of conversing afterwards without any true need of or benefit stated that the messenger of Allah disliked sleeping before the night prayer or conversing conversing of conversing afterwards. We waited for the Prophet one night until half the night had been reached. He came and led the people in the prayer and then addressed us, saying, Certainly the people have prayed and gone to sleep while you the here are continually in prayer as long as you are awake for the prayer. It is preferred to perform the prayer, morning prayer, early in its time. The believing woman used to attend the morning prayer with the, with the messenger of Allah completely covered in their garments. There, then they would go back to their houses after finishing the prayer and no one could recognize them due to the darkness. When does the person actually catch the time of the prayer? That the messenger of Allah said, Whoever catches the car of the morning prayer before the sun rises has caught the morning prayer. Whoever catches the raka of the afternoon prayer before the sun rises, sun sets, has caught the afternoon prayer. This ruling is not particular for only the morning and afternoon prayers, but is generally for every prayer. that the Prophet said whoever has caught a rakah of the prayer has caught the prayer making not missed prayers reported that the Prophet of Allah said whoever forgets a prayer or sleeps through it then he then the expiation is to perform it when he remembers it it is the one who intentionally leaves a prayer until its time finishes make of the prayer Allah has made it for every prayer an appointed time with, with, with set time, it begins at a specified, specified time and becomes void at a specified time. There is no difference between one who prays it before its time and one who prays it after its time, as each one of them has prayed it outside of its time. In addition, the making up of a prayer is a legal issue and such legal rulings 
are not permissible except by Allah upon the tongue of his messenger. If making of an obligatory prayer that the one who intentionally has abandoned the prayer did not perform until its time was finished, neither Allah nor his messenger would have failed to appoint, to appoint that out. They also would not have forgotten to mention it, and they also would not intentionally leave us with that without explaining the issue. Your Lord is never forgetful. Every law that has not been brought in the Quran or Sunnah is void. The times in which it is prohibited to pray. There are three times of the day concerning which the messenger of Allah prohibited us from praying or from burying our dead. When the sun lies first, occurs until it rises above the horizon during high noon until the sun goes past its zenith when the sun is leaning towards sunset until it sets the prophet explained the reason for such prohibition when he said to Amr ibn al-Basa pray the morning prayer and then refrain from praying until the sunrise and it is above the horizon for it rises between the two horns of the devil and at that time the dis disbelievers prostrate to it. Then pray for the prayer is witnessed and attended by angels until the shadow is the length of a lance, which is high noon, and then refrain from prayer, for at that time hell is seated up. Then when the shadows start appearing, pray for the prayer is witnessed and attended by angels until you pray the afternoon prayer after that refrain from praying until the sun sets for it sets between the two horns of the devil and the disbelievers prostrate to it at that time time and places that are exempted from the prohibition as for the time that is that it is exempted it is high noon on fridays this is based on the statement of the Prophet. No man makes ghusl on Friday and purifies what he can uh, what he can and puts on some oil of his oil and applies some perfume from his house and then goes out without coming between two people and then prays what has been written for him to pray and remains quiet while the Imam speaks but he will know will be forgiven. For what he did between that Friday and the previous one. In the Hadith, the Prophet is encouraging pray, praying that what has been recorded for the person and nothing prevents him from praying except the arrival of a man, the Bema. This view that said time is exempted on Friday was the opinion of more than one of the pious predecessors including Umar ibn al-Khattab. Hanba followed the view, saying the arrival of Imam prohibits prayer, prayers and his speech, but by prohibits speaking. Thus, he has made the cause of prohibition for, for prayer, the arrival of Imam, and not high noon.